art store good wow yeah it's being so good oh they have it that's what i'm looking for yeah mommy wants some brushes oh here you see the dinos huh wow Okay, so these are the brushes I was looking at online. Please do not touch the brush bristles. Oh. Okay. Anyways, let me grab something. Look at these. They're paint markers. Oh, fun. My. Liam, can you stay by mommy, please? Mom. What do you want? Did you find something you like? Show mommy. Okay, show mommy. What is it? No? Okay. <laughs> You're silly. This one. Yeah, I was looking at this. I never saw that before. It's been helpful. Yeah, Ready. Okay, let's go look for sketch pads. Want to help mommy look? This way. Look at this. It's so cute. I think. Is that all of it? That sign about top 10 things about pastels. Yes, there's so much stuff in this store. Let me go find Liam something though. Okay. You wanna look here? These are all like the kids stuff. You see anything, Liam? I'm gonna look in. These are paints. Color pencils. Here, go that way, baby. Yeah, look at all this stuff. Whoa. What is... Oh, ooh. You want that one? Okay, let me see it. Look at all the pens. Ooh. Wait, what is that? Oh. Yum. <laughs> okay, mommy's looking, mommy's looking. I kind of want one of these. Metallic. Does the metallic too? 
Yeah. Like a rose gold and a gold. Ready. Ready. This is a baby. <laughs> so cute. Wow, look at these fancy pens. Liam, look at him look. <laughs> Inks. Yeah, no touchy, okay. Wow, look at all this stuff. What? Oh, that does look funny. He's like a spider. You see the birds. Oh, okay, this way. Okay, maybe I should ask for the. Do you have any sketch pads? Maybe it's on the other side. I have this big one. It's really big, though. What is it?
we are now back home i did actually buy something from the last store that we were at um but i just bought like some stems for spring because they were 60 percent off um because they're off season so anyways yeah that was all i was able to get i didn't really look at all the ornaments that they had plus i like to buy stuff from there kind of like after the season so then it's on sale so anyways i do have my eye on a few things from that store so definitely we'll be going back um but i did want to show you what i got from the art supply store so let me just take everything out so it's not making so much noise I swear, every time I go into that store, I spend so much money. Today, we spent $72. And I still have yet to buy um, the notebook that I want for my watercolor. So, anyways, um, let me see, let me see. I'll show you the, the brushes. So, so, right now, I have this one. I'll pop a photo right here. And that is sable hair. Really expensive. Don't want to buy the rest because they're, they're a lot. Um, so I found an alternative. It is by Princeton. It is Princeton, Neptune, and I got the round brushes. So I got number 2, 4, and 6. And you can see the difference right there. 2, 4, 6. And let me see how much these were. So this one is $8.99, number four is $10.29, and number six is $12.99. I've heard a lot of great things about this, so I'm really excited because the other, I guess you would say synthetic brushes that I got off of Amazon that was like a set, set of five for, I want to say $8. It was really, really inexpensive. It's just not great um uh i don't know if you if i've already uploaded the watercoloring video but it literally stained like the brushes but the bristles on it is completely stained already and i used it once so i already know i'm not gonna like it um so yeah i heard a lot of great things about these brushes and they're a little bit more affordable than the sable hair one that i already have so there you go um so yeah i guess got three um i'm probably gonna go back and get the number zero um later on but for now i think the two is fine enough for the meantime so those are the brushes that i got and then i did get uh two markers because i want to use them for stamp making um again i'm not sure if my video would be up already but i'm going to be making um pre-made wax seals over on my shop and I'm so excited. I have yet to play around with it. I ordered a bunch of different colors that I wanna make and just like a bunch of different stamps that I wanna put in like a little collection together. Um, but anyways, I also wanted, I was gonna do like glitter on it, but sometimes that just looks so messy to me. I would rather do like the metallic so like the designs on the stamps will pop up more um so i just got these two metallic markers we'll see if they work i believe these were 309 each so one is a copper color kind of like a rose gold and then the other one is a gold so those are the colors that i got um and then the last two things that i got here are some paper pads for water coloring so this one is a what is this called okay so six by six so this is 879 and it is one of the paper blocks or easy block i don't know i don't know how this works never used that but there's 15 sheets in this and it is cold press so it should work great um but yeah i just thought i would get a six by six and would make like i don't know little artworks on them and then i can pop it in my planner or something if I want to or even make cards out of this I think it's just really like a cute size and then of course I got a pad like a good pad <laughs> but this is like $12.49 for 12 sheets so it's pretty much a dollar a sheet and it's just like 
<sighs> you better be worth it. This is the 400 series. It says best. So it better be really good. Um, I mean, I am looking at it and it is already feeling a little bit better. Okay, a lot better than the one that I got from the dollar store. So that's that. That's everything that I got. Sorry if you hear noises. Liam is here with me, of course. And whenever I speak, he has this thing that just like, he also needs to make a noise in the background. So that's just what is going to be happening, I feel like, throughout Vlogmas. Every time I vlog, there's going to be some type of noise in the background. But I'm liking my hair today. You guys, speaking of hair, I feel like my hair isn't growing. Like, it's been this length for like an entire year and I can't even. But I am really feeling this dark color on me. So I do get my hair done, I believe, on Monday. And because like, I don't know if you can, oh, there, oh you see the grays? They're everywhere, you see them? You see my grays? There, there it is, there it is. They're all over, so. I'm just going to have her touch it up and then probably put a little bit more brown in it. We're just going to stick with brown. I don't want to do blonde anymore. Um, so yeah. Anyways, that's it for now. I don't know what else is going to be in this vlog, but I'm going to go and uh, work on new products for my shop. I still have to finish some artwork, so I do have a lot of things to do and I kind of have a headache. So I think I'm just going to kind of like relax and draw and take some headache pills because the migraine is starting is starting we have here Inuyasha and Kagome Nandroids I purchased these off of Good Smile Company um, I purchased them last oof, I want to say February and it is now November so it took that long they have been delayed I don't even know how many times but they're here and I'm excited. I also have Kikyo coming in in two days, I think. Like this Friday, it will be here. So I'll definitely unbox that one with you guys once it gets here. Um, but for, for now, we're going to open these guys. So let's do Hagome first. I'm so excited. I don't remember how much these were. I think they're around like $50. But like during pre-orders... You get some sort of discount or something. I don't remember. Again, I ordered it in like February. So here is the box. Kagome Higurashi. Yeah, I said it right. I'm like <laughs> blanked out for a second. Was that really her name? But so these are the poses that they have. Oh my gosh, wait. I didn't know she could sit down. Okay, so I'm definitely going to have her sitting down because I'm going to have Inuyasha sitting down. That's like my favorite pose of his right there is when he's sitting down. Um, so anyways, she's also going to be sitting down, but you can see she can do other poses. She can hold the bow and everything. So I'm really excited. Look how cute. This is her yelling sit boy, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> okay, so let's open it. I'm excited, you guys. I've been waiting for this for forever. And yes, I keep the boxes for all my Nendroids. I only have two Nendroids like real nandroids i only have two i have a fake one of nezuko and tanjiro because i was like oh i'll just buy a fake one inside no it's awful and then i also bought a sakura one and it's just awful like don't buy knockoffs you guys it's it's bad they don't even stay together it's it's really bad so anyways so we have the instructions right here she comes with a ton ton of things so again, I just want to put it together where she's sitting down. So it's this one. She really only requires, it looks like, three things right there. But it shows you how to put it together. I'm not the best at these. I feel like I go really slow when I do these. So this is the back part. You get like the stand and then extra arms right there. Really hard to show you without a glare, but there you have it. Actually, you know, if she's going to be sitting down, she might not even need a stand. We'll see. Oh, it looks like she does. Okay. 
I'm not sure. This one? Okay, and then this is like the main pieces. Oh my gosh, she is so cute. So you get like three faces and there's her arrow and her bows and then like another bottom half. Oh my gosh, so cute. Okay. Let's see, let's see. Oh my gosh, she's adorable. Okay, so there's always like plastic in between pieces. So we're gonna have to take her apart, taking her head off here. So their hair usually come off like that. Ta-da. Oh, wow. Oh, it looks like it got pinked right there. Can you guys see that? It's really faint, but I mean, with her bangs on, you can't see that little pink mishap. Oh my gosh. The cutest little face. I love it. Yeah, because all her other faces are angry. Like she has this one, and this is the one where she's like yelling. So we're going to go with the cute one, okay? Which is what's already on here. <laughs> and then this is the bottom half. Here's her bottom half where she's sitting down. Look how cute. Cute little legs and skirt. Okay, so. This is her other bottom half, the legs. How cute is that? There we go. Oh, how ladylike with her legs together like that. Oh, so cute. Okay, I'm gonna do different hands, I think. I'm gonna switch the arms to, um, instead of straight, I wanna do um, ones that's bent. I'm gonna switch, you can take like the little hands off, can you see that? <laughs> so cute. Oh my gosh, look how cute, so cute. So yeah, I still have her body right here and then like all the other pieces are still here. Okay, so now on to Inuyasha. I'm also going to have him sitting down. So he matches with Kagome. Here are the poses he can have. He can even have this one laying down. It's so funny. Oh, how cute. My favorite. I love this. Okay. Let's open him up. So like the other one, you have the stand and then extra hands and arms. And then this one has him in it with his extra faces. I love this one. So cute. Oh my gosh. Okay. I think I'm going to keep him smiling. So he, he's smiling at Kagome. Just literally just like this. I love, love this whole look. So 
Here he is. Oh my gosh, he's adorable. So just like the other one, he has, you know, plastic on him. So we're going to take him apart. Um, the arms for this is totally different. So we're going to gonna take his bottom half off and his arms as well. Okay, let me just take his body off. <laughs> okay. And here is his bottom half. That. These are the arms that we want. Oh my god, how adorable! Oh, I love them. There you go, guys. I can now put them on my shelf. I'm so excited. You don't even know. Um, I will update you guys once Kiki arrives and we can put her together as well. Oh, I didn't show you. This is Inuyasha's sword. Look at that. That's Saiga. And his, his sword when it's not like fully transformed. So there you have it. That is everything. So happy. I'm going to go ahead and put them on my shelf right now.